promised you another video about SES and uh, the amazing satellite business that's going on here in the Isle of Man and we've come out of the cold and the bleakness of Douglas Head. Just down from the hill, yeah. Richard, uh, obviously I have to explain, we can't show much of this, this is, this is sensitive stuff that's going on in this room to some degree. To some but there's, degrees, yeah. there's a lot of Star Trek involved there, isn't there? Well, you know, well that's, for me, for me as a that's basically complementing what we've seen up uphill there with the big antennas. This is a monitoring room, so we are monitoring the functioning of the antennas from that room, as well as we are performing two two other functions here. So we're actually planning. A colleague of mine is doing this, Sir Dr. Worsley. He's planning satellite maneuvers here on the Isle of Man, which are then sent to headquarters for check, and commands are beamed up. Right. So literally, you can control these satellites. Uh, no, we're not yet commanding. But it will happen. Oh, might be, but first of all, it's the monitoring of our satellites. It's monitoring the teleport side. It's planning maneuvers from here. Mm -hmm. uh, we know that there's two more potentially planned. Could this, in your view, be a really major part of SCS's business uh, in the future? Would you like to see that happen? I, I hope we, we can grow the facilities here on the Isle of Man. That's, that's our plan. Uh, will it be a major site? If you compare this to a major site in Princeton and Luxembourg, no. No, that's But huge, uh, getting a little bit to, to the, let's say, the Middle League, why not? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And where's the, where's the future of satellites still the thing, or is it all fiber? We had that conversation before, ah. before but I mean, it, it's moving fast, isn't it? The it's, whole thing? It's. it's moving unbelievable fast so we see all the changes not just in broadcasting we see it in telecommunications and networks as well but uh, you know the whole world is asking basically for broadband and internet and connectivity as such so well, there is a massive growth still all over the world for for the next years to come and any idea of how many people this will employ eventually because it's, it's a growing business isn't it i mean we we already employ uh, 15 people plus uh, uh i think another vacancy is, is is just out the interviews had been done mm -hmm. um the teleport project last year brought bought <coughs> five colleagues uh, four colleagues there um and uh, luckily and sometimes you always uh, you also have to have luck um, we we have brought two mengsies back from the uk yeah um, one is a senior broadcast engineer and the other is a, a young PhD with, with family. Our number three was transferred as yes internally uh, from Princeton to the Isle of Man, English, but his uh, right. parts of his family were already living here. And number four was recruited locally. And this is, this is right up the uh, Isle of Man government's thing. This is what they'd like to see. This is the high-end, the high-tech sort of stuff, right? Yes, it is. And a future here. Uh, definitely, uh, this is an infrastructure business and uh, in telecoms, and this is by definition long term.